All right, so the Saiyan Day celebration has officially begun, and in today's video, we're gonna find out exactly what they have in store for us global players, or actually global and JP players, but I'm assuming that there might be some minor differences between the global and JP celebrations. Maybe, I'm not sure. Either way, let's uh, pop into the news here and see what's going on. So we have the Proud Warrior, Saiyan Day campaign is on. Get Dragon Stones and other awesome rewards through the login bonus and missions during the events period. Uh, new stages will be added to a token event, which of course is the Majin Vegeta token event, and Super Battle Road. In addition, the Awakening Medals obtainable in the Extreme Z battle can be used to Extreme Z Awaken Observance of Pride, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegeta, which of course is the uh, Super Saiyan Blue Evolution. Vegeta. The subpage of my profile has become available as well. On the subpage, you can check the number of battles participated in by each character and the number of stages cleared for each event type. So this was actually supposed to come out when the update first dropped, but I guess they were either calculating something or they had some issues, but now it's finally available, which is awesome. Enjoy the events from the Saiyan Day campaign. Okay, so there you go. We're starting here with the login bonus, which is very standard for every campaign. We're also gonna be getting some special missions, and I think they said in the Dokkan Now program that it's up to 33 Dragon Stones for the missions, or something like that. I don't remember, but it's like 30 something. And then we have the Majin Vegeta Dokkan Festival banner with the side unit Super Saiyan Kid Goten and Super Saiyan Kid Trunks, and that's coming out at 10.18 p.m. Pacific Time on the 17th, which is technically tonight, and I believe that translates to 2.18 a.m. Eastern Time, I think. I could be wrong. What you guys can do is head over to the Dokkan Wiki, I'll put a link in my description, and there's a countdown to the exact moment that the banner drops, so you can definitely use that as a reference, but the point is, this banner is coming out very soon, it should be in about 5-6 to six hours, depending on when you're watching this video, and your boy will be live when the banner drops, I know it's been a while since I've done one of those streams, but this is way too hype for me to wait a second longer than I have to, so I will be live on the channel to stream some live summons, so if you guys are available at that time, then feel free to uh, tune in and summon with me, okay? So after that, we have the Elder Kai banner, nothing special. We have a new Proud Warrior pack, which is available in the pack shop. And uh, this will include tickets for the Majin Vegeta banner. We also have some Dragonstone sales, and it looks like they're okay. I would have preferred one of those like special packs for like 50 stones for $2 or whatever it was before, but uh, we do have a lot of 32 stone packs, so that's nice, 5 times, and then a 91 stone pack, 8 times. So, yeah, better than average sale, but really not great. I definitely think they could have done better, but it is what it is. And we also have the new Majin Vegeta Dokkan event. Uh, we have the Extreme Z area for the LR Goku Jr. and Vegeta Jr. And we also have a new support memory added to the World Tournament Reborn event, which is, I believe, the Vegeta's Pride slash Majin Vegeta uh, support memory, and I gotta say, man, it has probably one of the best animations <laughs> in the entire game. Like, not just for support memories, just like overall animations, this is one of my favorite in the game for this support memory, so I'm definitely excited to get that. And we have a new story event for the Goku Jr. and Vegeta Jr. where we can farm the copies and their Awakening Medals as well. It's kind of weird that they put the story event after the Extreme Z area. Usually it's flipped, no? I think it is usually. Like they show you where you can get the unit first and then the Extreme Z Awakening Medals. It doesn't really matter, just a little bit strange. Anyways. From there, we have two story events returning, the ultimate final battle, as well as the most fearsome Majin. We have a new stage of infinite Dragon Ball history, which is stage 19 versus uh, Giant Ape Power. 
and also the Endure Extreme Z Battle for Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta, which is not dropping immediately. Just to be clear, it's coming out on the 23rd, so we gotta wait for almost a week before this comes out, which is unfortunate, but it's alright. And uh, we also have a new stage for Super Battle Road, which is coming out on the 22nd, and this is for... Um... I forgot. <laughs> Gotta be honest, man. I don't remember exactly what the category is. I know it's stage 54. I've mentioned the category many times, so I'm sure a lot of you guys are aware. Feel free to let me know in the comments, but I forgot. I'm sorry, guys. It's something like... Uh... Roded body and mind mate. No, it's not that. I'm not sure. I apologize. But new stage of Super Battle Road dropping on the 22nd. We have the Mastered Evolution Category Summon, which is definitely a big skip for everyone. And then we also have uh, the new section of Dragon Ball Story with a bunch of new stages and uh, free Dragon Stones, of course, which is great. And finally, uh, explosive Chain Battle versus Good Boo dropping on the 27th, my favorite event in the entire game, next to World Tournament, of course. They're both awful. I don't know which one I hate more, but uh, hey, Skill Orbs are always good, so there you go. Uh, new Chain Battle, new stages of Dragon Ball Story. Super Battle Road, Extreme Z Battle for SSBE, new Infinite Dragon Ball History stage, uh, new story event, new free to play LR, Extreme Z Awakening for the LR, new support memory, uh, Dokkan event, and Dokkan Festival banner. So those are the highlights for this same day celebration. Um, overall, it's pretty decent. It's pretty solid. Not the best celebration we've seen, but it's pretty good, I would say. It's pretty eventful. We got a good amount of stuff to do. I'm excited to stream all of it in the coming days. And uh, like I said, guys, summons coming soon. Live at, I believe, 2.18 a.m. Eastern. It should be 3.18, but there was daylight savings. So you know, we, we went back an hour. So um, yeah, I think it's 2.18. I think it is. But once again, I could be wrong. Don't hold me to it. And lastly, before we go, let's just quickly check out the login bonus. I know that for the first login bonus, we're getting this amazing Toya Toro. Um, is it Toya Toro? No, Toyo, Toyo Toro. I think I've been saying his name wrong the whole time. Toyo Toro, wallpaper, Majin Majida, one of my favorite arts, honestly, for Majin Majida out there. And then we have uh, 12 Dragon Stones because it's 3 plus 1 plus 8, a reverse uh, reversal hourglass medal. And then for the rest of the days, it looks like it's going to be one stone per day for the remainder of the campaign, which is pretty standard. And finally, for the missions, yeah, like I said, up to 33 Dragon Stones can be obtained during the campaign, which is above average. And uh, make sure to do your daily missions and then complete your uh, limited missions as well for all 33 stones. Make sure you don't miss any. And most of the stones are really easy to get because it's just consume X amount of stamina. So there you have it, guys. That is the 2022 Saiyan Day celebration for Global. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about it. Um, were you expecting more? Or are you satisfied? Are you excited for Majin Majida? Are you going to be summoning for Majin Majida? You know I definitely will be. So I will see you guys on the stream. And uh, that's it, as always. If you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And uh, until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out. <laughs>